With the help of DCM integration, you can now directly edit object geometry by changing its dimension value. For example, in past versions of Vectorworks, if you wanted to change the width of this hallway, you would be required to resize the hallway and the dimension would update accordingly. With version 2010, you can edit dimensions and the associated objects will change appropriately. The changes can be made in a couple of ways. You can change the dimension either from the Object Info palette or by double-clicking the dimension text. Notice you also have the ability to set a fixed point when changing the dimension through an on-screen widget. This new capability can significantly improve your workflow as you can begin to introduce dimensions far earlier in your design process without fear of dimensions being incorrect downstream. This is achieved because the dimensions can now have bi-directional association to objects in Vectorworks. As an example, if I create a viewport and dimension the objects in the annotations layer, the associated dimensions are modified either by your dimension input or by geometry changes. Notice the objects update in the viewport, which also means they update on the design layer. This new capability in 2010 truly gives you the freedom to apply the workflow of your choice, with the benefit of knowing your changes are intelligently reflected throughout your design.